I would like to talk about building construction process which is divided into pre-construction steps and during building construction steps. Today we will see some of during building construction steps. Whenever we have to build a building or house, we must have to do site exploration to get complete information of site for fixing safe bearing capacity value and for safe type of foundation. Here we have used boring method of site exploration. The other methods we can use are open excavation, subsurface soundings and geophysical methods. Now this is a concrete mixing machine which is used to mix cement, aggregate, sand and water. We can use this at RCC work and for constructing footing, column, beam, slab, lintel. It is second class brick used for the house construction which is slightly irregular in shape. Now this is the front elevation view of house. Here is the parking area which is 2.5 meter by 5 meter. Now at the entrance of the building we can see lintel. It is a horizontal structural member which is fixed over door and window. Moving ahead we can see seal which is the lowest horizontal member of window. Then we can see plinth level which is normally 1.5 feet high from ground level. This is the entrance of home. There is a hall, a bedroom with attached kitchen and bathroom. Here at the end of the building we can see another same type of building are constructing where all the column size are of same size and the column are made of 16 mm vertical column reinforcement and stirrups are 8 mm in size. Now this picture shows the section of a stair. The technical terms associated with the design and construction of stairs are step which is a portion of stair. Then riser is the vertical portion of a step providing with a support to thread. Then going is the horizontal distance between two successive riser faces. Then there is string and waist. Right now I am on first floor. Here we can see U shaped staircase which is also known as half turn staircase with continuous flight and one landing. Here we can see fine aggregate of 4.75 mm in size and then we can see angular shape of aggregate in 10 to 12 mm size. Then we can see bricks and bricks beds. Brick beds are used in concrete as an alternative to coarse aggregate. Here we can see in the upper part of the wall all the bricks are laid with its length perpendicular to the face of wall. All these bricks are laid as header. So it is known as heading course or header course. It is the side view of the building. Here, chajas are provided over window to provide protection from sun and rain and for architectural purpose. We can also see column and beams. Now, we can see here reinforcement bars are used in the basement slab. This is showing that half part of the basement construction have been covered by reinforced concrete. I hope you can get few ideas related to house construction by this video. Thank you.